Oh wow, okay. Hello everyone, welcome to 2007 progress video number 68. Me and my friend in before beta, he was like, hey you wanna go to DK's? I was like, oh what the hell. So we decided to go and uh, we just got a dehatchet. Where hatchet, please? We've been here for just, actually we've only been here for two Rex kills, so. Yep, there we go, there's the hatchet. Thank you. There's the dragon hatchet we just got, so we'll be splitting that after this trip. Alrighty guys, well my friend had to telly out because he ran out of food and whatnot, but I think I need to telly out now too. I still live for a little bit. So here's all the loot I got. I got a clue, a couple of Rs, some dag bones, a uh, tooth half of a key, and he got of course the dragon hatchet which he sold for 750k, so I'm gonna get my split of that. Ooh, maybe I can stay for one more. We'll see. <laughs> oh boy. 22 HP, let's go, die Rex, come on, die fucking die, this is about, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, fuck it, I'm gonna drink a brew, okay, we're good, <gasps> a Renar, yay, I think the only herb you can drop is Renar, yeah, alright, time to tell you out and uh, get my split of my dragon hatchet, alrighty, time to get our split, should be like 300 something, thank you, Alrighty, well, that was a pretty fun first trip to DK's. We got that dragon hatch right away. And these Dagonoth bones are about 4k each, and we have 12 of them, so, I mean, that's 48k. Plus, we have a clue, so that was a really successful first DK's trip, to be honest. Okay, well, I did not expect that to be the reward. That was only a 3 clue clue scroll. But, uh, alright, that was an extremely successful DK trip, considering we got, I don't know how much we all made off the drops, but then we did our clue scroll and we get a Zami page, so, Dagonoth Rex was very good to me. There's a Zami page 3 and some Alks too, so, that's an awesome clue. Excellent. Alright, well, I'm going to get this stuff sold, and then I'm going to be heading back to Pest Control to get my mace. Alrighty, guys, well, I'm all done with Pest Control for the night. Um, alright, let's see, how do I explain this? So, when you watch this video, there should be one video for it. It'll be a real-life one explaining about why I can't make any videos for this coming week. Well, actually, by the time you're watching this, it would have been the last week. This is really hard to explain, but this is the last pest control I'm doing before that week starts. So, we are currently at 162 points, and now I have to log out and not do any more pest control until this coming up Sunday. It is currently uh, Tuesday night, so... Uh, you should all have seen that IRL video. If not, watch that first. You know what I'm talking about right now. Otherwise, you're going to have no idea what I'm talking about. But, uh, alrighty, we're at 162 points. We only have about 90 left to go until we get our mace. Alrighty, guys, we finally have our 250 points. I'm all done. It is Sunday afternoon now. But, uh, I'm all done. And, uh, alright, we got 250 points. Just didn't take too long to be honest I expected this to take longer because it's been a long time since I've done pest control and I didn't really remember that pest control is actually fairly fast to be honest considering um, I'm in a friends chat so we barely ever lose it's like you pretty much always win games so alrighty well let's buy our void knight mace confirm alrighty there we go with a void knight mace we can now use that to autocast or claws of gothics. So, uh, I'm assuming I'm probably going to head to DK's now. Alrighty, guys. Well, I did take a trip to Dagonoth Kings. Unfortunately, I made the mistake of not turning my private off. So, I was streaming. I am streaming this right now. And a couple guys kept bringing uh, Prime and Supreme over to me. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Please die. Please die. Please die. Finish. 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 Oh, my God. YOLO. 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 I have a ring of life if shit gets really bad. Please die, please die. Oh my god, two health, please die. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Bass! Eat it! Eat the bass! Eat the bass! Oh god. Okay, this might not be my last kill then. Be right back. Alrighty, this is definitely the last kill. We're low HP again. Come on. Oh shit, 17, 18. Come on, finish, finish. Please die. Fuck, one more cast. Come on. Berserker ring for the go! Oh, fucking troll! Okay, I gotta tell you. Okay. Alrighty guys, well that was my first ever DK solo trip. Um, like I said, I made the mistake of leaving my private on, so the trip did go shorter than it probably could have because I wasted some brews that way, but did not get any rings. We did get a clue scroll and all these bones though, so unfortunately we did lose a lot of money that way, considering runes are expensive as shit, but uh, alrighty, we're going to do our clue scroll and be back with the loot from that. Alrighty, this might be the reward. Let's see. 
What the fuck? What? What the fuck is that? That's horrible. GG. GG. Oh my god. Look at this shit. Look at this. Let me pause this. Look at this shit. These two fucking guys, they glitched back here and they're dropping shit. There's a fucking whip. I tele grabbed a pumpkin. That's all I grabbed though. And there's another fucking whip. They're dropping it where you can't grab it because it's behind the things. This is. What the fuck? Look at these two guys. Bool5 and Relaz. They somehow glitched behind the bank. And we're all back here. This is ridiculous. This is so cool. Now, the only thing I tell you guys was a pumpkin. They, I know, they dropped a bunch of coin stacks, some D squares. I don't know. This is insane. This is so weird. This is so fucking weird. Alrighty, guys, we are here at Barrows. Uh, pretty much what I'm doing right now is I'm gonna be doing Barrows probably until the rest of this episode uh... basically because i'm honestly i'm wasting time until i the slayer helm update comes out that's really what i'm waiting for i want the slayer helm to come out really really bad cause i just wanna i wanna i mean i love slayer but i wanna have a reason to do slayer so when that slayer helm comes out i'm gonna be super excited but anyway alright that's enough talking about what i'm doing in the future what you need to know is now we're doing Barrows. I'm trying out Claws of Guthics. Um, at this point, I would say with gu full Guthans and SGS and this, I should be able to loot the chest like 20 fucking times in one run. But, uh, okay. Alrighty, guys. Loot number one of the video. Shit. Alrighty, loot number two of the video. Nothing. Mm, loot number three of the video. There's also a guy over here rocking the Claws of Guthics. Well done, my friend. Well done. Uh, nope, nothing there. Loot Quattro. See, it's weird. When I have all these runes in my inventory, like, I don't even notice the difference, because... I don't know. When, uh, you know what I mean? When I have all all kinds of runes, I basically have every reward you can get in my inventory, other than racks, which I'm actually going to take out. So it, sometimes, if you're not watching inventory, it looks like I literally just get nothing from the chest. Loot Numero Cinco. C. Loot number six. Excuse me, Mr. Varax, man. I'm going to run on top of you for a second. No, I'm not. I don't know what I'm doing. Sorry, sir. Just give me a moment, please. Thank you. Got nothing. Hexa loot. Nothing. Loot number eight. Although I don't recall saying loot number seven. Oh, fuck. Is this the part where I get all fucked up? <sighs> loot number eight. Loot number nine, and someone from my clan chat says that masses give him Viagra dick. That really is all I have to say in order to get an item. <laughs> God damn it. First double digit loot, loot number ten of the video. God damn it. An item would be lovely at this point there, Barrows. Alrighty guys, loot number thirteen. This is actually really awesome. I'm gonna get all... I mean, wait, 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 I'm at loot number 11, excuse me, I got my numbers mixed up. Loot number 11, I brought 12 doses of super attack and strength, and we are going to get all 12. I cut it a little close with the prayer potions, but uh, I'll know that next time. This is incredibly awesome. I think I might start using this more often. Obviously, it's losing me money because I've lost like 500 blood runes so far, but at the same time, if you can do 12 loots per run, I mean, it just seems worth it to me. Alrighty, loot number 11. Ah. Alrighty, loot number 12. Unfortunately, this is the last loot of the episode, regardless of if we get an item or not. This episode isn't too long, and 12 loots is not that many loots, but it's been a long time since I made a video, and I just need to get this one out. So, alright, loot number 12. Can we get an item to end the video, please? Nah, we can't. But we did get, actually, over a thousand deaths, so... Uh, we lost... About 570 death runes, I mean bloods. So I probably actually might not have profited off these runs. I'm not entirely sure, but, uh, well guys, that is it for this episode. I'm going to go sell this loot, but, uh, it's not anything spe spectacular, so I won't show you what I get. Um, that's it for this episode. Next episode, I'll probably be doing some more barrows and DKs, trying to make some money. 
uh, in anticipation of the Slayer Helm release so that I can go hard at Slayer. So that's it for this episode, guys. See y'all later.